Hey y'all, welcome to Creekside Cubing and welcome to this video featuring my thoughts on the Yushin Little Magic. Now, these cubes are super amazing and they're gaining a lot of fame. Uh, in the last while, people have been kind of raving about these cubes and unfortunately my video um, about them is kind of a little bit late to the game, but that's okay. So I've had them for quite a while, unboxed them a while ago, and um, have played around with them a lot, broken them in, lubed them, and definitely have an opinion of them. Um, I have played with the black one and the stickerless one quite a bit, and yeah, um, you guys have probably seen other people's videos talking about their exact performance, and you've seen what they can do. Um, I think comparing the two, I might have to prefer the stickerless one just because of the very, very fine, um, I'm not sure what you would call this type of plastic, but the finish on the plastic, it's not like very, it's like a very fine version of what you might see on the Shang Shao Gem or the Chi Warrior or something like that. Kind of, oh yeah, I remember, they call it a frosted finish, but it's a very fine frosted finish. And it just feels very, very pleasing to the touch. Um, let's try to do a couple of algorithms here. Oops, run through an F perm or two. Um, it handles so well, and like with DNM 37, it just feels really great. I'm actually tempted to try out, uh, what's it called, Speed Cube Shop, I think has like their cosmic uh, magic, where they um, set it up and add magnets. I have actually, to this day, do not have a magnetic 3x3, at the time I'm making this video anyway, so I would really enjoy um, experiencing what this can do with magnets. And I would probably prefer to get it in stickerless for that. The black one, it feels a little different. So apparently the the um, material, the plastic material is a little different. Um, I'm not sure how I would say. This one seems a little smoother. Although that could be just lube. Um, and it, you can hear it sounds a little quieter. But again, that could be just lube. It seems like this one's a little bit bumpier. Um, could be that I need to um, use some internal lube along the springs. There's gonna be some spring noise there. But there's just a little bit more resistance. And, hmm. This one seems a little softer, I guess, is how I would talk about it. So, both of these are very, very good. Um, it's really just kind of a preference of do you like stickless, do you like black, do you like white? I imagine the white one would be like the black one. But um, I think these are great, great budget cubes and definitely worth having in your collection. So definitely pick one up because they're quite cheap and among the best budget cubes out there, I would say, as far as 3x3. So yeah, that's my thoughts on the Yushin Magic. Um, thanks for watching. Catch you all later. Bye.